Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 2008 Weekend Warrior FS2600. This is a front sleeper. This is a popular floor model. Also comes with 5500 watt generator and fuel station. You see this has the fiberglass cap on the front and also diamond shield incorporated in there. It's not really diamond shield, it's just an aluminum plating that's in there. It kind of helps protect against rock chips. Power jack on the front. It does have saddles on the frame already. Down the side, you can see we've got some wild tattoo style graphics here. Front storage compartment. Gives you room to uh, securely lock up your camping equipment or riding gear. There's also outside speakers. A big awning. It's got chrome wheels. A little bit of rust on the center caps there. Wouldn't hurt to replace those. And big windows here too. So if you've got a view of the dunes, the mountain, the lake, enjoy lunch while you have a, uh, a room with a view, so to say. Really neat array of lights across this back fiberglass cap. You can see our rear ramp is in good condition. Looks like we've got LED lighting in here too. And of course down the side, Again, graphics are good. Weekend Warrior was, at the time, the number one toy hauler manufacturer in the world. And uh, still quite popular today. 5,500 watts give you enough power to do just about anything you want. You dry camp, anytime or place. Let's take a look at the interior. Okay, you can see this one has a galley midsection. So we've got a refrigerator freezer combination here. It's Dometic. Looks like it might be possibly newer than the coach. Kind of hard to say. There's also, oh, this, I like that. Lockable pantry sliding. Lock it up so your canned goods aren't all over the place when you stop at your destination. Uh, we've got a stove here, three burner, with a microwave oven beneath. No oven on this unit, just the uh, upper uh, stove top. See our windows, cabinets. I'm just going to pan around here and let you get a good look of the interior. That's the top. There's storage above all the cabinets. You can stow uh, riding boots, helmets, that th sort of thing. Looks like we've got a uh, oh a swivel set up for the television here, so you can change it to different angles. There's some recessed lighting, window valances, tie-in with the fabric on the sofa. It's even got the Weekend Warrior embroidered right in. Now we have a sofa on the one side here. We do not have the fold-away booth chairs that came with it. So you probably have to bring your own uh, or uh, get your own, however you want to do it. It does have both the tables intact. They can be set up in different spots. You see you got the different holes in the floor. Lots of grommets, tie downs throughout. It's got rubber all over the floor. It's a non-skid traction surface. Got a little snarl right there. And more of the aluminum plating right where you enter when you come on so you don't uh, damage anything. This is a sofa, believe it or not. It folds up and goes up with the power bed or you can place it in the down position. So you can have a single bed or a sofa and above it, we have a queen size bed. There's a privacy curtain. Up front, you see we've got, oh, it looks like kind of a Corian countertop set up for the sink. It's a dual basin. It's got the flex hose, paper towel rack, um, AM FM CD player missing the face, apparently. That didn't, didn't make it in with the rest of it. In the center, we've got our bathroom, again, the Corian countertop, um, kind of a recessed medicine cabinet here, more storage below, and a closet. The bathroom's right across the hall. We've got a foot flush toilet. There's, this is actually a tissue dispenser. Medicine cabinet, mirror on the wall, and a big shower tub. It's got, these are the neat kind of uh, shower curtains. Just, fold out of the way quickly. There's a skylight above. A little bit of peeling here. It's not water damage. It's just kind of nature of the beast. And up front, this is the bed platform without a mattress. We can um, supply a mattress if that's something you don't want to get your own. 
it does have a TV box up top, so you can have a television back here. The whole upper wall, two sides, solid cabinetry. And the Weekend Warrior leather embossed window valances. Storage access, you can, uh, there's the battery boxes down there. There's also storage to that. Remember that compartment we saw outside? You can use that for a laundry chute if you want to put a basket down there and drawers underneath. So front sleeper, generator, fuel station, lots of sleeping capacity, weekend warrior right here at Gibbs RV in Coos Bay. Call 1-800-824-4388. See us on the web www.gibbsrv.com. That's G-I-B-S-R-V. Dot com. Remember, we take trades, we offer great financing, and we can even help with delivery arrangements if you happen to live out of the area. Give us a call. Gibbs RV in Coos Bay.